Hello, my name is Matt Ambrosiak, Cloud Security Architect at Checkpoint. This is a high-level overview of how you can assess the security posture of your Amazon Web Service accounts with CloudGuard Dome 9 compliance and governance. With Dome 9, you can achieve continuous compliance using popular compliance standards or custom rule sets. Dome 9 can show you non-compliant assets within your cloud accounts with the option to auto-remediate as well. In the compliance and governance module, I have compliance rule sets. Each rule set is a collection of rules. Each can be used to run assessment reports based on compliance standards such as ISO 27001, SOC 2, NIST 800-53, NIST CSF, PCI DSS, Cloud Security Alliance, GDPR, HIPAA, CIS Foundations, and many more rule sets which are proprietary to Dome 9. You have the option to modify the existing rules within rule sets or create new rules or rule sets from scratch. You can use the playground feature to query your cloud assets using the Dome 9 governance specification language or GSL. The rule builder makes rule writing easy, even for first time users. Here is a rule to validate a data classification tag is being used for all EC2 instances with an acceptable value of high, medium, or low. You can run ad hoc compliance reports and assessments for one account or all AWS accounts. For any report, I can see high level statistics at the top and explore the findings on the bottom half of the report. All reports are exportable and can be printed with the option for an executive summary report as well. When we expand out the findings, any rule will give us a list of non-compliant assets. Each rule has a unique rule ID and when we click, I'm taken to the GSL knowledge base to learn more about that rule. I can click on a non-compliant asset in the report to investigate in the central management console. With the read write mode enabled, I can fix this issue right from within Dome 9. An alerts console lets me see all non-compliant findings across all cloud providers and cloud accounts. We have the option to permanently exclude findings if exception criteria is met. The continuous compliance policies feature maps rule sets to accounts. We can define notification policies. When defined, assessment results will automatically be delivered to email or other systems for ticketing, or auto remediation can be triggered for non compliant assets. For auto remediation, I can deploy CloudBots into my cloud account, an open source and fully supported technology add on. For example, if an instance is exposed, I can quarantine it. If an S3 bucket is unencrypted, I can automatically encrypt it. Dome 9 sends the findings to CloudBots, which is hosted and invoked within my own cloud account to give me peace of mind. To learn more about CloudGuard Dome 9, please visit checkpoint.com.